In a landmark ruling, a federal judge has ordered J.P. Morgan Chase and company CEO, Jamie Dimon, to set aside two days for the deposition of what he knew about the bank's relationship with convicted sex offender and former client Jeffrey Epstein. Tuesday's ruling comes after multiple lawsuits have been brought against the bank by allegedly abused women, and the U.S. Virgin Islands, where Epstein had a home. The alleged victims and U.S. Virgin Islands are seeking damages from the bank. J.P. Morgan is also separately suing former private banking chief Jess Staley, claiming he concealed what he knew about Epstein and should cover potential losses resulting from the lawsuits against the bank. The U.S. District Judge Jed Rakoff in Manhattan has decreed that Jamie Dimon can be questioned by plaintiff's lawyers for five hours and a two-hour question period by Staley's lawyers. Rakoff may extend time upon request. J.P. Morgan originally offered a three-hour window for Dimon's questioning. J.P. Morgan has expressed its sentiment stating that Jamie Dimon had no knowledge at all of Epstein's activities and never met or spoke with the disgraced millionaire. Jeffrey Epstein was a client at J.P. Morgan between 2000 to 2013 and continued to be one, even after his 2008 plea for a Florida state prostitution charge. It has been alleged that as early as 2006, J.P. Morgan had knowledge of Epstein paying cash to bring in underaged girls and young women to his home, yet did not heed internal warnings to sever ties with him. Jamie Dimon took the leadership of J.P. Morgan in 2005 and has not been implicated in any wrongdoing. Jess Staley, the former CEO of Barclays, expressed regret for his friendly ties with Epstein and is currently facing the brunt of J.P. Morgan's lawsuits. The two-day trial is scheduled for the 23rd of October. Epstein was awaiting trial for sex trafficking in a Manhattan jail cell when he committed suicide in August 2019. This case remains in focus by the media and the general public, as its outcome will set a standard for ethical business practices by banks. It is also a reminder to be vigilant and work with utmost integrity and commitment.